Inside the Yaselsi Father's Heart Clinic, there is a poster on the bulletin board about parents taking good care of their children. Outside the clinic, we see it in practice. Three-year-old Winston Alexander and his mom, inseparable. Meanwhile, back inside, Courtney Cape is missing her mama. Mom, Dad, I love you. <laughs> I'm sure everyone feels that way. Nevertheless, back outside, we see our four brave students from Incarnate Word heading off for another day of serving Guatemalans at the Aselsi Eye Clinic under the watchful eye of their two dedicated instructors. I, I want to see um, a willingness to serve. I want to I see their hearts. Mm -hmm. I want to see if they're coming for the right reasons. That's the way it's always been since the Rosenberg School of Optometry has been sending fourth-year students on one-week mission trips to Chichi Constantinople and Aselsi Ministries. A great partnership. And speaking of solid relationships, let's go back outside to Winston Alexander and his mom. Or should I say Winston and his phone. Have you been able to use your phone since you've been here? Yeah. Yes, I have my phone, I have Wi-Fi, we have good Wi-Fi up in the casa. <laughs> and Winston has his toys, he loves them. Same could be said about the students inside the clinic discovering their new playthings they'll be using this week. This is incredible, this equipment is just unbelievable that we have. It's very high tech, I was like really surprised. Has to be considering the patients they serve inside the clinic. Extremely high prescriptions, rare eye diseases, challenging stuff. Meanwhile, back outside, Winston is making friends. Back inside, the students are doing the same. Students do get a lot closer to each other on these trips. And speaking of trips, back outside, Winston is taking one. Needs to check out some new digs. Back inside, Kim is thinking that's exactly why she came on this trip. And I've always wanted to expand my help to other countries. Yes, I love traveling. Especially when it's under the watchful eye of people who care. At times, it's almost a parent-child relationship. For me, as a teacher, it's important for them to let them figure out on their own first. Mm -hmm. But if they need help, we'll definitely be there. Yes, they will. At times, making suggestions even when not appreciated. Back outside, Winston Alexander is very much aware parents can be a little pushy at times. Dr. Maki, the unofficial cook for this year's team, says he's just egging them on. But hey, it's all good. The folks mean well. They're so encouraging and patient with us, and um, they've taught us so much. But they let us do our own thing. They're like, you're the doctor, and they've really let us, you know, shine. shine they did. More than 100 very needy Guatemalans can attest to that. Not just with their professional skill. Just reading glasses or, you know, any type of correction that I can give them. But with their servant hearts. Lives were changed. Outside and inside. I mean, it's showing me that my services really do make a difference. I feel like um, I do have a mission out there, which is to serve others. And finding these new new characteristics of myself that I never knew I had. Mm -hmm. um, I think that's what's going to build me into a, into who I'm supposed to be as a doctor and as a person. Mm -hmm.